Tammy Houston is waiting for a heart scan. The past two years, she has not been feeling well. A flutter sensation in my heart, and which forced me to cough, and also a little bit of chest pain and um, kind of a heavy, heavy feeling. Thanks to the latest technology, Tammy finds out today if these symptoms are caused by heart disease. Kootenai Medical Center is the first non-research, non-teaching hospital in the world to use the dual CT scanner, and the quality of the results are better than they've ever had. And it's ushering in a new era of cardiac imaging um, where you can actually non-invasively look at the coronary arteries, which is something that we've never been able to do. The coronary arteries supply blood to the heart. When plaque builds up, they become narrow. If this goes undetected, it could cause a heart attack. By pumping dye into Tammy's body, there is contrast and the scanner gets its best picture possible. This is the heart right here. Before this technology, the dye was injected through a tube that was maneuvered through the leg or the arm and into the chest. A much more expensive and in some cases risky procedure used only if the patient has a high risk of heart disease. The new technology is less invasive and is used on a wider range of patients who show symptoms like Tammy. It's up to a third of people uh, uh, may pres first time they find out they have heart disease, maybe when they have a heart attack or uh, sudden death. This technology allows more people to be diagnosed long before that ever happens. These little things coming off here are the coronary arteries. These are the you know objects of interest. Good news for Tammy. Her arteries are clear. No answers yet about her chest pains, but she knows it's not heart disease. What a relief. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome.